All right, y'all, real quick, let's go through this. Let's look at the lifestyle of grubs. You can see here, lifestyle, life cycle. You can see who you've got here, the months of the year. This is where we are in April, but let's go right here to June. These beetles are often called May-June beetles because, or June bugs because they come out in June. You'll find them in your pool filter or definitely you'll find them on your porch lights. What they do is all during the that month of June and in July, they lay eggs in the lawns well-watered lawns, and those eggs hatch into small grubs that feed on grass roots to grow. As they feed on grass roots, they get larger and larger, and then when it starts to get cold, depending on where you live, they will go down deep for the winter, and then they're down there, and then as we get to the spring where we are now, they come back up. This is, uh, what is this, a pupae, a pupae stage right here, and they're about to hatch here. There is a little feeding that might go on right in here, then they hatch and they go. I'm not typically worried about the feeding that goes on in here because your grass is growing so vigorously, you usually won't notice it, but some feeding can happen. And then they launch out and now the cycle starts all over. So that's how it works. This is why we're gonna put a preventative down right here, right in this range here. Let's just ruin this drawing. We're gonna put a preventative. We're gonna put a preventative down right in there somewhere, right? So when they get to this point, We've got that preventative down protecting us all during this point. And as you're gonna find out, one of the products we're gonna look at today will actually kill any of these people that are doing any spring feeding. But I just wanna let you know, that is the life cycle of grubs. 